The Age of Enlightenment is happening all across the black community, and of all people, it is being spearheaded by Kanye West when he sent out the seven words that went viral all across the internet. They were, I like the way Candace Owen thinks. Now Candace Owens is a young, articulate black American who stresses freedom of thought and ideas for all Americans, regardless of race, policy, or religion. When you hear that, you say to yourself, well, that is just basic common sense that should apply to all people all the time. Unfortunately, the Democrat Party has been strangling black American freedom of thought, not by physical means, but a psychological one that has been destroying their community and family for decades. Here is a statistical fact that cannot be debated or ignored. Back in the early 1960s, most black Americans were conservative. They had the lowest divorce rate amongst any race. In fact, the emphasis of their family structure was a strong black father who did a fair day's work for a fair day's pay and was a cornerstone for their values and religion. In a more simplistic way, but easy enough to understand, remember the sitcom Good Times when James was the father figure of the nuclear family? You dare not argue or get in trouble with the man, and there's always a meal on the table in which he provided for his family. Simplistic, yes, but a perfect example of what most black American family life was like during this time period. So what changed all that? It was a socialist revolution that began infiltrating the Democrat Party. They would send activists into the poorest of the communities and tell them the reason why you are poor is because over a hundred years ago your ancestors were slave and although five generations have been passed down you are still incapable of providing structure and income for your family because of these past injustices. So instead of providing you a better education or learning the value of a hard day work we will create a welfare system in which we will provide you with just enough assistance so you can barely squeeze by in life but become dependent upon and passed down through future generations. Worse yet, they perpetrated a scheme that the devil himself would be proud of. All throughout the black community they placed stations in which any woman could be as promiscuous as she wants and if you get pregnant they will kill your child for free. Democrats convinced them this was natural and the right thing to do. So let's fast forward to the present. A young, articulate woman named Candace Owens burst on the scene like a wildfire. She told her community and whoever would listen to stop living and blaming all your troubles on your past that has nothing to do with today's environment. Go educate and prepare yourself for the future because that is what is ahead of you. Decades from now, if you stop blaming and start bettering yourself, you can become successful, for you control your own destiny. Social icon Kanye West heard her ideas and said he liked them and endorsed her point of view. Social activists and Democrats put on a full assault against this type of ideology, and they tried to stress to the black community that freedom of thought is no longer an option. You must fall in line and follow the social agendas we have set up for you that have failed your family for generations. However, many people in the black community are hearing her words and taking them to heart. A new social revolution is taking place in the black community for they also realize the words this young lady spoke was nothing short of the truth. Thanks to Candace Owens' ideas, and Kanye West's endorsement, a shining light is being spread across the black communities everywhere, and I believe the Enlightenment process has now started. Godspeed.